ever met. I think they're the coolest people in the world. Oh my God, I love their big midget head. Da, 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 da. I like their little midget arms. I just want to tickle them every time I see them. I love them. I like that big midget ass they be having, that big midget ass. They sit down, they get taller. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, baby. Standing up three foot three, sitting down three foot seven. Love me a midget ass. They're good people too, y'all. They put up with a lot of crap. It's a tall world, you know? They smell farts all day long. That can't be easy on them. Can you imagine walking through cloud after cloud of that, man? They're awesome, though. I got protested by some midgets, though. They didn't like to be called midget. They want to be called little people. Okay, I got two problems with that. Number one, it's not specific enough. If I say midget, y'all instantly know what the hell I'm talking about, right? There's no gray area. There's no, hmm, I don't know who gonna be. If I say little people, you don't know if it's a midget or a kid or a Filipino. You don't know, okay? <laughs> You just simply don't know. <laughs> Plus, I don't think they're little people, okay? I think they're grown ass men and women. They just stopped growing because they're not sitting at the little people table at grandmama's house at Thanksgiving. You know that card table with the one jacked up leg we all had to sit on when we was kids? <laughs> sitting on a damn piano bitch eating off Chinette. No, they're at the big wood table, ain't you? Now somebody get him a phone book. Get your little midget ass up in that chair. <laughs> <laughs> And by the way, if y'all ever have a midget over for Thanksgiving, don't ask them to pass nothing. That's just rude. Okay. Come on, what's he got? About a nine-inch reach? Come on, y'all. Get up and get your own cream corn, you lazy bastards. That's what I'm trying to tell you. They told me that I could also call him a dwarf. A damn dwarf? That's a magical, mythical creature. That ain't even real. A damn dwarf. Maybe I'm old school. I say you're not a dwarf unless you're in the direct possession of a battle axe. That's how I roll, okay? No battle axe, no dwarf. What, the elf took it? I don't believe you. You're just a midget with an attitude. Get this, though. They told me the word midget to them was as offensive as the word nigger was, the N-word. I'm like, are you crazy? First of all, there wasn't 400 years of slavery of midgets, okay? <laughs> we weren't stealing them from the island of Lilliput or Oompa Loompa. You know? Right? We weren't. We weren't stealing them so they could come over here and pick cotton on their tippy toes. Nobody knows how many farts I smell. Nobody knows my sorrow. Now, for those of y'all didn't really understand how great a joke that last joke was, you have to remember cotton's a very short plant. <laughs> Thus, the humor when I'm reaching up on my tippy toes. <laughs>